Hi everybody, it's Brian, uh, Witch Doctor Advanced Practical Shooting Series. Uh, this test is the what's called the quote-unquote cooking the round in the chamber test. And so what I did is I uh, grabbed my six dasher, loaded up a whole bunch of rounds, went to the range and fired several rounds um, and averaged uh, or measured the average velocity of five shot groups across a different uh, ranges of temperatures uh, in my barrel. I have temperature strips on all my barrels and as you can see here we have 86 degree temperature, 95, 104, 113, 122. The average velocities when shooting uh, the five shot string rapidly, usually about two to five seconds in between each shot, um, the velocities there are fairly stable uh, with the same exact charge, bullet, seating depth, etc., and the same exact atmospheric conditions. Uh, however, when getting the barrel cooked up to 113 degrees and then leaving the round in the chamber for 30 seconds, each five shot uh, is taken with the round in the chamber for 30 seconds. Um, at 113 degrees, you can see that the velocity jumps quite a bit uh, from 2935 to 2950. So we're looking at about an average increase in velocity of about 15 feet per second when you leave that round chambered for 30 seconds. At 122 degrees over here, you can see the uh, velocity increase from about 2932 to about 2944. Uh, so again, another appreciable jump in velocity, about 12 feet per second increase. So what this test tells me is that yes, leaving that round in, in a hot chamber is going to cause it to increase in velocity uh, by probably at least 10 feet per second, uh, but up to about 15 feet per second. And so this information now is informing uh, what, what I'm planning on doing when I'm shooting uh, strings of ammunition and matches um, to basically uh, when I see my condition that I want to shoot in I'm going to then chamber my round and fire immediately um, not chamber the round wait for the condition and then fire um, certainly you can do that with your first couple of rounds you know because your your uh, chamber and your barrel aren't, aren't that hot at that point so under those conditions yeah sure that's probably acceptable to leave that round chambered for a while. However, uh, when you do uh, increase your barrel temperature, uh, this is where you will likely uh, experience an increase in the velocity for those shots, for those rounds that are quote unquote cooked in the chamber.